So today I want to look at this Fish Logic nitrate filter. Um, around here we have nitrate of about 50 parts per million in tap water. This should help alleviate some of that. Okay, so the first thing we need to do really is test the tap water. Now for this we're going to fill this to 5mm which is there up with tap water. So let's go and do that now. Okay, to make this as fair as possible, um, I've left the tap running for a little while just in case there are any deposits. Um, let's get about 5mm. Let's have a look at that. Okay, that's 5mm. Now I do believe, let's get the lid. Let's go over to the fish tank. We'll do it on the fish tank, make it easier, wouldn't it? Let's have a look, here we go. Okay, so the first thing we've got to do is find number one. Right, so there's number one and number two, yeah? So we've got to shake this for 30 seconds, I won't bore you with that. Okay, shook for 30 seconds and off and it says six drops. So, let's have a look. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, the next one is this one. So let's undo the lid on this one. It does say another six drops, so let's have a look. One, two, three, four, five, six. There you go. And then we put the lid on and give it a gentle swirl, and I'll show you what I mean. Okay, lid's on, and then all we do is this. So. That's just to mix the two compounds together, okay? You do this for a nitrate test anyway, okay? And then we are going to wait. 10 minutes, so we'll come back in 10 minutes. Well, it'd be instantaneous for you. We'll come back in 10 minutes and we'll have a look. Okay, so let's have a look at the result. So here is the list. I would say it's probably 50. If that's 40, it's probably 50. So I'm getting 50 parts per million out of my tap water. That's why you need. So I would check your tap water before you even buy a filter, but definitely have a look. So, let's go and run some water out of this thing and see how much difference it really makes. Okay, so there's the filter on and running. I'm doing this with a glass. So let's just take some water from this. There you go, that'll be enough for our purposes. Turn that filter off. Okay, so let's go back inside and get some readings. Okay, so that's the five mil, so let's do the six drops just to make sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, and six drops of the other solution. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Now remember. On that last test, it was 50 parts per million that I was putting into my tanks. Let's see what happens now. So let's give this a quick shake and wait 10 minutes. Okay, so where do we come? Maybe two. Maybe two. That's very clear. And there you have it. So. Just remember, when you're doing a water change, main, the main area is to remove nitrates, but with our tap water in the UK, you could be putting nitrates in. Be mindful first, test your water, see if you need one. I'll put the link to where I got this in the description. Secondly, it does have an effect on pH, very slightly, but it has made a difference. Now, I filled up three tanks with this yesterday, and my pH is quite high. I've got very hard water around this area as well. Um, and it dropped it by about 1%, okay? So to put that into terms, I was still I was still in the eights, uh, but it dropped it instead of 8.2, it was 8.1, okay? So bear that in mind. 
but again the nitrates are what i was looking at here so thanks for watching guys take care